Hello guys, welcome back to my channel, Tekin Boy. So this is the third episode of uh, special Unisim design video series, and today I will be talking about the connection between PVT Sim and Unisim design. So PVT Sim is one of the, the popular software, yeah, used by uh, oil and gas engineers uh, to generate a definition file of the oil and gas. Yeah, it's either the crude, the the heavy fraction, the naphtha fraction, the kerosene, or yeah, anything that relates about the oil and gas, yeah, uh, especially the generation of the uh, pseudo components, yeah, it is one of the best software there. And the output of the PVT same software is the PVT file. So here I have an example of a PVT file uh, that, uh, yeah, this is just a sample case. So yeah, you can use any kind of uh, PVT file here yeah it, because this is just for an example uh, usually each PVT same software have the sample fluid yeah you can use that one you export the file here uh, you could see that this file contains the information about the components about the TC PC and then about the pseudo components yeah we have uh, several here the properties of the pseudo components yeah so this is basically a definition of uh, fluid uh, yeah an oil and gas fluid so uh, it, this file uh, is able now to connect it to unisim design yeah so it is quite a useful feature because uh, some of other software also receive an input of pvt files hits and unisim design also able to do that uh, uh, the result will be slight different with the oil manager. If oil manager that we defined it, say it will be treated as a special stream, but here a PVT file, uh, it is will it will be act as a normal stream. So uh, without further ado, let's go to the Unisim design. Uh, this is the the early page. Uh, we click the new case. Uh, after the simulation basis manager appears. Uh, you will directly go to the enter PVT environment button. Then I will click add. The next thing is I will uh, select the engine. I right now already ha only have one stream loader. I will click launch engine. There is there are two options here: the PVT sim file or the shell. ED. SDF file. I will choose the upper part. Yeah, if it is same file here, I will choose the file here. Yeah, any sample stream. Uh, then a pop up will appear here. Now uh, it will ask whether you want to change the fluid package. Right now the file is def defined in SRK. Yeah, there is an option to change into the PR seventy eight. Uh. But right now I will uh, try to use the normal SRK. Yes. Yeah, we will wait for a while yeah, for the import uh, process to begin. Okay, it's it is done. We could see here from the compositions of the fluid is defined now. Yeah, so it is defined automatically, uh, and you could see that the fluid package. Yeah, the fluid package is SRK. Okay, now you can leave the environment and you could see here, the first thing is from the component. The component is automatically defined by the PVT file. So I don't need to have any input uh, and definition of the high post, but it is done automatically here by the PVT file. Uh, the next thing is about the fluid package. You could see that uh, the fluid package is also automatically defined here uh, by the PVT file. Uh, so let's go to the simulation environment and let's see what's there. Okay, you could see here that a stream called PVT file test is appeared. Yeah, it is created by the PVT file in the PVT environment. Uh, so yeah, it is uh, similar to the oil manager where you can install the oil stream, but you could see here that the stream is a normal one. So there's no such symbol like in the oil manager. Uh, this is just a normal uh, stream. So uh, the composition, you could see that uh, it is defined already. So we just need to put the conditions only. 
Uh, let's just put a random number. Yeah, you could see that uh, it is very easy to define PVT file uh, stream, yeah, because it's like a normal one. Okay, uh, now I will try to test this stream with a new fleet package. I will try uh, to name it as SRK test. And then I will scroll down, I will search for SRK. Okay, I will compare uh, between a normal definition of uh, components with the PVT uh, definition. Okay, I will try to name this SRK test. Okay, I will uh, define from other sheet. Okay, now I will change this into SRK test. Yeah, I will compare these two. You could see that even though we have the same uh, definition, but there is a slight difference between these two uh, methods here, yeah, between the normal definition with the PVT file definition. Why? Because uh, it is the PVT file is made from a different software. So yeah, it is uh, very common to have this difference, but you could see that the difference is not that much. Uh, so choose wisely whether you want to uh, uh, use the normal definition way or using the PVT file, you should know where what is the best, uh, what is the most closest to the real plant conditions. So yeah, that's it. Uh, uh, the video uh, I have shown you about the feature of PVT file connection to Unison Design. I hope yeah, you guys can do it also yeah, in your own yeah, case or projects. Uh, thank you for watching and see you in the next video. Bye-bye.